it's cocktail o'clock again with Soraya. This time we're going to be making something quite interesting, something quite really interesting, really. It's a espresso martini. So let's get into Soraya's treats, cocktails. Yeah, it's going to be great. I'm really looking forward to this one. Hello, Soraya. How are you doing? Hi, let me let me walk backwards. Let me get you in. How are you doing? Really good, thanks. Yeah, how are you? I'm good, but, but what's this? I mean, we've got a cocktail, um, a cocktail machine, an espresso machine out today. We have, we have. We uh, can do the espresso martini. Espresso martini. I'm going to get right set up on the tripod now, because what I've noticed is this front-facing camera isn't as good as the back one. So I'm going to set up and we'll talk yeah. all about this espresso martini. Right, Soraya, I'm super excited by this one. Um, I'm not great with coffee, mind you. I'm normally like the freeze-dry type of... Uh, yes coffee drinker but what do we know about espresso martini so we know there was an entered in the 80s yeah a famous bartender in london called um oh god dick, dick, barsdale. dick barsdale he that's right he was in a bar in london and a guy had come in a model at the time yeah and said um can you give me a wake wake me up drink right so he's like well what drink would be great to wake me up a coffee so what he did was have a vodka a plain traditional vodka martini yeah Got a shot of espresso, right. put it into the mixer, shook it, give it to the gentleman, this model, who was, you know, quite wealthy and, and you know, yeah. well known. He had the drink, loved it. So the actual name came from that espresso actual Martini. experience. Yeah. Wow, amazing. And it's, so 1980s, early 1980s means it's 2022. So it's about a 40 year old drink now. Yeah. Um, how, let's, let's, let's get into it. Well, first of all, we got some Smirnoff. We got some of this Mallow's coffee. So it's spiritual. a coffee liqueur. Okay. We got ours from Bath. There's um, a person in Bath who got their own factory. Love uh, Mallow's. They're really good. Um, they're they're sweet. This liqueur, um, the ones you can get, we've got one here, which is very popular in all Ooh, cocktail bars. Yeah, um, it's a great um, liqueur, but it's not as sweet as the one we get. So right. it depends how you like yours. If they, this is just as good. So again, this is, can be bought in any store. Mm -hmm. um, as the Tesco book is anywhere, you can get that, that's fine. But we found that our customers really liked the one. We just tried as a one-off. Yeah. People loved it. And um, yeah, it's just a coffee liqueur that's very, very sweet. Oh, I'm excited to get into this one. And that's what that is. Um, simple syrup. Okay. We only put it in here because it lasts longer. We put it in the fridge. Yep. It's just normal simple syrup. And Smirnoff vodka and some coffee beans for decoration. Some coffee beans. The main ingredient of oh, our espresso. Is it? Um, so, it's just ground roasted coffee. Right. Um, what we do is, do you want me to start? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you, you you, I'll tell you what, no, I'll, I'll walk you through it. So if you just get, now this guys, I'm just gonna show you, is the spoon, ground coffee spoon. If you can put enough in there, that's one whole scoop. Right. If that's okay. Here we go then. My first ever espresso martini. My wife's got these machines. Um, do I fill it up to the top? That's or? fine, yeah, yeah. Grab all of that and put that in there, I suppose. Yeah, it's quite a lot, so it might be a little bit too much. That's all right, it is. You did that really well. Look at that. Yeah, did that really well. There we go. And then if you look at the bottom, this. Oh, yeah, this oh. Acts as a, yeah, there we go. It's a level. Look at that. There we go, there we go. Let right. Let's get that in. So, there we go. I'll just move this out your way now. So, what we do. And this is a bit, even I hate this bit, right? So the machine is so small, if you just pop this in, okay, on the side like that. I know right. you guys can't see this, but basically you put the scoop into the top of the espresso machine. You hold the hands on, you twist, so it's nice and tight. Right, yeah. Okay, then you put your cup underneath and you literally just, if you want to press espresso, there we go. I made one once, once and the thing flew off. Is that really? ever happened to you? Um, I've tripped myself a couple times where I haven't put it on tight enough. Yeah. And I went, go to tighten it and it just splashes everywhere. I, <laughs> I'm not good. I'd rather serve a pina colada or a tequila sunrise and a latte or a cappuccino. That's what that's what put me off, to be honest. That's what put me off the... We're going to make it. It, it, blew up. <laughs> it, it just went bang. I didn't put it on properly. It went bang and I had coffee all over me. Hot well, coffee. <laughs> yeah, it's not, and it doesn't smell the greatest. I don't no, like the smell of coffee. So um, now the it, espresso is done. Literally, that's it. If you show the camera... It's just a normal espresso. There we go. Then we'll put that to the side. And what we'll do now, part one, part two of the shaker. And what's this? The jigger. There we go. We got it. I, I think jigger. I got this now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And now, as usual, scoop of ice into the part one of the shaker. Scoop. So it's, there we go. Perfect. There we go. And then 
we put that down. Now what we do then is start to make the cocktail. Okay. We have a shot of vodka. Right. Do you know, I'm starting to feel a rhythm with this. Yeah. I'm starting to, I've got, I'm on my toes and getting the ice. And, Isn't it you know, fun? Yeah. It's, I it's, think it's um, fun. I always say in all your videos, guys, before you criticise anything, it's just for fun. Um, like I said, we've never had a comp complaints if people um are happy with what we serve we just continue to do the way we do it yeah yes. that's it and we love doing it one shot of vodka into the ice chuck that in there yeah and then one shot of the coffee liqueur into the ice yeah i'm enjoying this i i, I am enjoying this you know like, you want to feel the buzz when there's people lined yeah. up and like oh what have you got what have you got and, and, and you kind of like... tell them what your favorite is to make <laughs> so yeah. my favorite would be a porn star or pina colada to make so i like, was well, it nice because then I get to make it in front of them and I get to go with it. There we go, straight in. So when's your busiest night? Saturday nights? Saturday, yes. We've got quite yeah. a few events from Christmas, as you, as you know. You've mm. seen all the events. Mm. So um, we do have a lot coming up. So um, yeah, it's been quite busy and I cool. love it. Brilliant. Now, What's that? Yeah. This is simple syrup. Okay. So it's just a pure sugar syrup. Right. Um, I told you before, we have sweet coffee liqueur. <clears throat> yeah. Not every cocktail. Um, now. My opinion is cocktails should be sweet and enjoyable. Yeah, yeah. Um, like the Long Island iced tea, it was quite strong, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. It didn't yeah. have anything really sweet in there to, to take that bitter taste away. Right. Now, with coffee, coffee and vodka together, if you think of vodka and coffee together, it could be like, oh, that sounds overpowering. Yeah. Do you yeah. see what it does? Yeah, you yeah, know, coffee's yeah. strong, vodka's strong. Now, with the liqueur, the sweet liqueur we use, and the um, simple syrup, it takes that bitterness away. I'm hoping right. you can taste it when we make it. We'll see. Sure. It is just a normal simple syrup which you can buy anywhere. And I'm having a big shot of this. Well, we just dash it. But okay. it's, yeah, and I'll show you now. And again, this is just guesstimation. You guessed it. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. And now you get your espresso and you pour that over the ice with the vodka and the liqueur and oh, the syrup. Oh, wow. Look at this. Fab. It's warm. Yeah, yeah. Now there won't be one in a second. Oh no, with the ice, yeah. So if you yeah. pop part two straight on there now. Oh, this is this is really cool. It's really simple. I give it a good, give it a good. Oh, uh, a massive one because it's hot drink. Oh and my god! Yeah. Freeze it. Yeah. And there we go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Got the Perfect. condensation on there. Yeah, and now with this one, if you just shake it for another ten seconds, and I'll show you why. If you just take it, shake it for another ten seconds. Okay. Yeah. Now this is like the Paul Star Martini, a frothy drink. Right, okay. So if you put that straight on to stop the ice from going into your martini glass. Yeah. And you know to push that, yeah? Push that to there. Pull that slowly over. And get a little froth on that. Oh. Let me just move this cup so you can see. <laughs> Look at this. Wow. Look at this, yeah. Absolutely perfect amount. Yeah. Look at that. Oh no. Look at that. And Look then, at that. The coffee beans are for decoration only. We usually put three on. Just because in the middle, three dropped on just looks the part and decorative. Oh, they float. They do because of the froth. So that's why I want to say the extra vigorous shaking. Yeah. Look at that. And it's cold as well. Look at it's that. It's cold. The espresso is nice and cold because of how much we shook with the ice. Yeah, it's freezing. <laughs> Oh yeah, totally get this. You can imagine like somebody full day modeling, tired, coming in, wanting up. something new. What what thought though to go? Well, do you know what? I'm gonna mix a couple of shots of of, of, of coffee in a with coffee. some. A, a and, and look at this. All oh, right. But you right. can see the froth. Yeah. And that extra yeah. ten seconds of vigorous shaking. Look at that. Yeah. You should be impressed with yourself. I'm really really impressed with that. I've yeah. been to bars yeah. and they pour it and there's not one bit of froth. And I'm thinking. Okay, like sh this has got to be know. yeah yeah. It's just with the coffee bean flow is very Instagrammable as well, isn't it? it that is. lovely picture. It is. Can I try it? Of course, it's yours now. Oh, it's so good. Can you taste any sweetness at all? I like a bitterness anyway. I, I, yeah. I, I prefer bitterness yeah. to sweetness. That's so enough, yeah. you do get a little bit of sweetness, but then it's 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 lovely. It's it's very intriguing actually. It's, you're definitely getting that shot of coffee, but you're getting that, that little tickle of vodka on the back. Yes, yeah. Yeah, and, and it's a, a bit of a longing bitterness, but yeah, absolutely fantastic. So you like it? Oh, I'm going to be making these myself. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, That's oh, one of the things you drink them. <laughs> oh, come, yeah, I'll put, put it back into the use. Yeah, yeah if you don't like your coffee, machine. you can make a espresso martinis. Oh, I, I'm really, really pleased with that. I mean, the next time we're there, we've got a Prosecco night coming up. We're going to come on December yeah. the 9th. The 9th is an unlimited drinks night. Unlimited yeah. too. So I'm, 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 I'm probably going to have a couple of those. Yes. Um, you know, I could have done with a couple of those Saturday night, couldn't I? <laughs> Wake me up. I've, I've already mentioned in the video that oh, okay. I, 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 made <laughs> I didn't some, know if I was going to stop. I made it. some videos where I said, oh, I had a right, I had a right night on Saturday night. Well, he, you, know. he, you didn't even finish the last beer. I didn't finish the no. last beer and I was walking and I did that walk of shame, saying I'm never drinking again. <laughs> well, when you were walking out, I was like, where are you going? Like, you lift that, like, you were just gone. Just got absolutely <laughs> gone. So I can't remember going home, I can't remember getting to bed. No, I could have done with a couple of those. This yeah. is absolutely delicious, really good. I'm glad you like it because, mm. like I said, again, people criticise me for not liking everything on the menu. Honestly. I'm only human. I can't like everything. I don't like coffee. I think you're doing great. But I know that we make them so well just because of the compliments we have. The liquor we buy is not going to be any um, bad if you use the other liquor, but we just use what's mm. best for us. And mm. people are happy with what we serve. And like how you made that then, we take that much time and care into making that cocktail for other people. Brilliant. They're like, oh my gosh, can we have two more? Can we have three? Because they know they're not going to get that perfection yeah, everywhere yeah, you know yeah. i'm not saying we're perfect but we do put a lot of time and effort into our martini i'm really you're really kind of over the moon with that it tastes you fantastic. really yeah 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 uh i'm glad what are we doing next week what's the next video what's the next um grab a menu there see that one there's 22 cocktails why don't you just pick any one you fancy should we pick a cocktail so what we've have done we corn star flatter? strawberry have we made a pina colada no we haven't that's a popular one there's quite a few pina colada Espresso martini, which we've just done. We've done the woo woo. Yeah, no, we've done sex on the beach, which sex is on the woo -woo beach. without the member. It was just one difference. Um, totally up to you. Candy floss pops nice, or um, tequila sunrise. That's tequila sunrise, um, or a pina colada. Yeah, they, we've done ma two martinis now. We've done a Long Island, we've done a Tutti Frutti. Pina colada is a coconut one we haven't done. Let's do a pina colada next week. Yeah, yeah. because I think that's a very um, popular holiday drink. Absolutely. And a, it's my favourite drink. Oh, I said that quite a few times. Yeah, like, no, no. Pina colada, pina We, I think next week we should make two. Two, and you can. We'll, <laughs> yeah. we'll, we'll have some fun. We'll drink I together. I think we should have two. Just yeah, we'll, we'll keep favorite. a door locked, and we'll just yeah. have a bit of a. Yeah. Uh, Look at people talking. Yeah. <laughs> They're trying to come in. with such a drinking pina coladas. Yeah, brilliant. Oh, lovely. Thank you very much for no, it, and you. I'll see you next week. No, it's been a pleasure as always. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Thanks, Boom, storm the crows. Cheers. <laughs>